Hey subs, so guess what? I bought a new mower on walmart.com. But it wasn't from actual walmart.com. It's um, a Greenworks, which had amazing reviews. But David would mow for like 10 minutes and then it would just stop working. And then we could change the battery and get another one. And he'd mow for 10 minutes and stop working and then didn't work. So I called and one thing I will say about Greenworks is that I waited on the phone for at least 30, maybe 45 minutes before anyone picked up the effing phone. So that's always annoying. But she said, oh yeah, it's a manufacturing defect that happens in some of them. Just exchange it with Walmart. No big deal. I'm like, oh, I'm so glad I just waited on the phone for 45 minutes to have this two second conversation. And I'm really excited about packing up the lawnmower and in my car, there's a box and returning it. But I get home from my church meeting at 8 p.m. and I can't actually pack the mower in the box. So I put the box with all the accessories in the back seat and I put the mower in the trunk. And my sweet Davacito and I, we drive to Walmart, we get it out of the car, which is a hassle because it's all big and bulky. Like it's a gigantic box. Can you see this? Huge box. Take it into the store. The lady has to scan it with her fancy iPhone thing-ish. She tried to scan everything four or five times. Well, four different things she tried to scan a couple times. And it was clear like some of them were like UPS delivery labels. But she kept trying to scan them. And I'm a little mean. Like, and I'm thinking in my head of this old lady does not know how to use her stuff. Oh, you left your door open with the baby. Oh, that's right. David's got a baby today. So, she couldn't scan it. And I was like, can we just go to the return desk? Like, is it after 8 p.m.? It is my bedtime. So, she puts a Walmart smiley face on it. David also has a baby. I'll talk about that in a minute. I go to the exchange desk. She says, oh, they sold that to you from Marketplace, not from Walmart.com, so you need to ship it back. This is all a lot of inconvenience that I don't want to deal with for an effing lawnmower. I normally buy $20 used lawnmowers, and they are not this inconvenient. And the people I buy them from will usually come to my house and replace them when they don't work. So... So that's annoying. So we have a brand new mower that doesn't work. I can't return it. I'm probably going to have to call Greenworks again. I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. I emailed the marketplace thing that I need to return it because there's a manufacturing defect. So on a happy note, only one day, but the eighth graders at David's school get to keep a baby. And the baby like cries. He has to change its diaper and burp it. I don't think he burps it. Feeds it. You burp it? Yeah, he does burp it. So he's taking care of a baby just for today. It's pretty cute. Okay, that's it. That's my updates for Monday. So I think you owe On my way to work and to see this hair? I think you should change your I'm letting the wind blow it dry. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe blow it dry. I'm going to be late. So my first day I actually called in. Because I want to do homework, and this I'm day I'm going to be late. I, I might not be I a very good volunteer intern employee. First day of work, complete. It was like four, a little over four hours I was there. I'm not used to like, like I feel really stressed to be controlled by time. Yeah, but, oh well, day one done. So I'm in um, like this ethics class. I'm gonna have to take a test called personal professional responsibility. And so I have to memorize like all the, it's called model rules of professional conduct. So I just read this rule. Um, a lawyer's representation of a client, including representation by appointment, does not constitute an endorsement of the client's political, economic, social, or moral views or activities. So like, um, 
Like I could struggle with that because like you see when, or I don't know, you see when, when attorneys are representing certain people of extreme groups, you assume that the attorney actually like aligns with those person's perspective. So like, I'll say like some sort of like white supremacist extremist person. If I was representing them, it would clearly be assumed by the community that I supported that perspective. So I wonder, like that, that seems messy to me. Okay, more later. Happy Saturday morning studies.